well, there's been talk about um, uh, whether it is, in fact, it is attended uh, a paper. Um, the thinking, the thinking that I see right now is that it is not a fundamental human right. It is what you might call a thin right. It is a legal right. A right is sort of um, a negative in a sense. A right not to be excluded. Uh, you know, uh, you, you cannot be denied the right to be uh, to, to get on. In other words, you, um, if you have the money to pay for it, you, know, you cannot. The company cannot uh, deny you access. Uh, but it is not a fundamental human right in the sense of your traditional um, human rights. The human rights that we're talking about from tradition is that it is it is a protection against uh, governments, against arbitrary laws, um, and it, the, the access to the internet right now is not at that stage. Uh, there are countries that are moving there, uh, but if, for example, I were to say that you have this a fundamental right to get to the internet, what does it mean? I mean, does it mean that I must provide you the computer? Must I provide you the software? Must I provide you the electricity? So where does it end? So right now, it is not a fundamental right in the traditional sense, but sort of a, a limited right Some that some countries have. It's not a, fun, a human right in the sense of all countries having it. You know, human rights, freedom of expression, all countries have that. Um, but this internet access, it is still not a right that has reached that level.